Good morning. It's another beautiful morning here in Ibiza. Got the helmet on. Um, I've taken a few bikes out. And we're going to go to every single club on the island today. Should be an interesting enough vlog. I've got the boys with me. Um, and of course I've used Hasha Ibiza for the bikes, which I highly recommend. They're e-bikes and um, they're, just, they're just so much easier than using a uh, a normal bicycle for uh, somebody like me who's very unfit but it's a great way to see the island so I highly recommend it first up we're gonna go to Pasha it's not too far first trip to Pasha go that way so we're just uh, coming up to Pasha now you got downtown here part of the Grand Hotel very beautiful restaurant but Super expensive. The first club, Pasha, 1967. Hi, where do you want to go now? This is going to be a, a long video today. So we're just down at the port now. A lovely morning. Not sure how many miles this is going to accumulate all together, but it should be a should be a long one. Gavin just fell off his bike. I didn't get that. I would have stopped there. <laughs> wow. Yeah. I've been following Calvin, but um, it took us up one way streets the wrong way. So technically shouldn't be on footpaths with these, but uh, there's nobody about it anyway. So yeah, it's a cool day though. It kind of feels like you're in New York, just cycling around. Obviously all the terraces are outside at the minute, but um, people are popping out left, right and centre on the old uh, zebra crossings. So we've made it to Figueredas. A couple of people on the beach. What a day for a lovely day.
are just passing SVV. I am aware we're going the wrong way up the one way street. Beautiful hotel owned by Lionel Messi now. His group. Bet you didn't know that. So I'll show you some of the hotels. This one's for all the Playa and Bossa crew. We have just arrived at Playa and Bossa. Not a lot going on. Oh, we're gonna go to Octan, which was formerly Sankey's. Totally forgot the club was there. So yeah, it's just us up there to the club now. which was Sankey's Ibiza, for those who know or for those who don't know. I think it was something along before Sankey's as well, but somebody reply in the comments and tell me what club was called, because I can't remember off the top of my head. So yeah, next stop, High in Ushuaia. And we're on the home street. Just coming up to Murphy's Irish Bar. Many of you will know that place. Uh, La Serena is probably about the only thing that's open. We go to Bora Bora. Might as well. Let's get it in. Stick it in. Here we have it, we have arrived at Hayabitsa. Right, so somebody asked me the other day what was in place of space, so I was quite shocked that nobody knew already that Hay has been in place, and this would have been the third year. Incredible club, incredible. My favourite night here is Glitter Box. And across the road you have Ushuaia, another one of my favourite places to go on a Saturday. You can see Ushuaia Tower in the background with uh, the Hard Rock Hotel. So it has changed a lot in the last 10 years, um, <clears throat> even in my time. But um, yeah, it's a beautiful day and we'll just keep rolling. Next up, we're gonna go to Salinas to get to DC 10. And uh, maybe, maybe see some flamingos on the way because it is flamingo season. What's that? This would be my usual Saturday, coming down here. You obviously have all the queues. People queue, people will be queuing up all the way down there. Go inside one of the most spectacular venues in the world, by far. Um, now we're here outside the Ushuaia Tower. And the Hard Rock. This vlog was meant to be about the clubs, but when in Rome, eh? So, 
there you have Sirocco Beach behind me um, and the the third half they have an amazing sports bar in there it's so big um, don't really think it's ever used too much uh, third half obviously being American style because it's a hard rock hotel um, next up we will go to um, DC 10 so let's go where's the boys down that way but we're gonna go towards Cocoa Beach I apologize if it's windy um, so obviously I'm moving on a bicycle and there's a little bit of a wind I'm gonna enter Salinas where you can actually see the flamingos normally they were here last week I did try to get a vlog of the flamingos for you but um, I just didn't pick it up on the GoPro because they were quite far away via um, a bumpy route but that's what these bikes are for Oh, you can see the flamingos. See the flamingos today. I'm gonna have to use your camera. There's only about four of them. They're across the water. If I can use Calvin's camera, maybe I'll be able to see them better. Your hand in my one is look, it's rubber. You bend it in, stretch it around. Not it. We're just coming up to DC 10 now, but here on my right, this used to be an old aqua park um, with dolphins and that. Um, I've never actually seen anybody in it, so I might, I might try and see if I can get over the wall one day. Um, the only reason I know that is because many years ago, I went out for dinner with Tony Pike and we were coming up this road and he told me that. But, um, yeah, I think you get, get a gist of where we are. We're on, on the way back towards Playa and Boston now, so DC 10's on the left, because we've obviously cut across through the whole, um, well, through the whole uh, of Salinas. I can't think of the name. We have it, DC 10 behind those bushes. How many have been in there on a Monday? Some wild nights I've been in that club, I'll tell you that. Not so much for me, I don't go to DC 10 too often. Um, just personal preference. So obviously DC 10 is famous for being next to the airport. That's the end of the runway there. So next time you're flying into a beef airport, just look for the little club at the end of the runway. That's the San Jordi market over there. Um, and I think we deserve a beer. Do you do it too? Probably get one maybe in Final Burger or somewhere like that that's opened in San Jordi. I'm not sure how we're going to get to Amnesia because I don't know if we're allowed on the motorway with these. Getting to Amnesia and Privilege might be a, a struggle. We can go in the back of San Rafael and head to Can Tomas um, to get to San Antonio, so that's easy. But we'll figure that out when we come to it. Great burger place there. 
called Vinyl Burger, highly recommend it. So we're just gonna try and wing it all the way to the roundabout by um, B-Fit. This is my old office actually. Straight and narrow on the way to San Antonio. Um, we're going to stop off at Privilege again, I know it was there last week. And we'll have to go back on the way to go to Amnesia and then stop at San Rafael, maybe get something to eat. And then off to Pikes, whoa! <laughs> Supermarket, got a drink, what's up? Got a wee drink and now we're going to head up to Privilege and then over to Amnesia. So. Um, as you can see everybody's sitting outside because of the COVID rules, which makes no sense to me. What's the difference in sitting inside and outside? Well, I don't know, but I'm no expert. <laughs> so um, we've made it to Amnesia. Many of you will have uh, come up these um, bridge. Sorry, I'm losing my words. There's Amnesia there. So yeah, I forgot this bridge was here to be fair. So we're going to do Amnesia first. And that's privilege over there in the distance. Ah, oh, what are the chances? Did you know we were here? Didn't expect to see some of the boys. Odd. Go that way. <laughs> the top dog. Hello. <coughs> so yeah, we're outside uh, Amnesia now. Obviously this place has uh, got so many good memories for me. Yeah, that's the club. That would be the VIP entrance here. And of course, this would be the front of the club. Obviously the signage and everything is down. But uh, it's quite eerie to think about it. Oh, I've had some good memories here. It's in this car park as well. Um, unfortunately to get access to all the clubs, some of them are, um, have different ideas and obviously I've got to respect that, some don't want the club to be shown empty, some clubs um, have made changes and they don't want to show it yet, um, which is understandable, but uh, yeah, it's um, quite surreal isn't it, just to be cruising around here, we've just actually bumped into two of our friends there, which was, I don't know what they're up to, um, and this is the famous Amnesia bus. Many of you will have had your photo taken. So for old time's sake, first time getting my photo taken with the Amnesia bus this year. And then uh, obviously Amnesia is home to our row every Saturday night. So yeah, that's Amnesia done and dusted. I hope you enjoyed that. We'll cross the road to Privilege. Um, Amnesia is my favourite club, always has been. Obviously there is other clubs that I do really like, but in terms of history, um, I used to work for uh, Cream for a little bit, so I was there every single Thursday night without fail. So yeah, that's my favourite club, I'd love to know what your favourite club is, just reply in the comments. Um, and yeah, we'll keep going. I'm not actually that tired.
So that's us now entering the biggest nightclub in the world via the back dodgy car park. So yeah, there we are, we're a privilege. If you want to see inside the club, scroll back and watch my other vlogs. You'll see uh, I was in in privilege about two weeks ago. Weather's turned a bit worse. Just um, the way between um, San Rafael and uh, San Antonio, sort of on the road to Santa Agnes. Um, weather hasn't been great, it's, it's got quite cold. So we're going to head straight to Pikes and then we're almost finished up. Obviously, Eden and uh, S Paradise are next door to each other. Um, it's a lovely, lovely drive, even. This is a great way, great way, and I highly recommend to see the island. And it's not expensive. It really is amazing, like I can't thank any of you guys enough to comment on these vlogs Like it's kind of like we have the island to ourselves And just look how peaceful the road is and then there's that idiot there But it just shows the durability of these bikes um, You know, I've done this before, it was just, it was just an insane day So we're now at Cantamas Yeah, just outside Can Rich Vineyard, and then yeah, we'll be, we'll be at Pikes in like a couple of minutes. Obviously, we had to come this road because of uh, the motorway. We can't be on the motorway. Perspective of how it is at the moment, it's quite, it's 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 relatively warm. Like it's uh, there's a gentle breeze coming, but it's the time of year where all the farmers um, burn their bushes. So all you can smell is that wooden burning smell, and it's just like. It's just reminding me of my childhood um, back when I, I would go and visit my granny and stuff in the countryside. It's just, it's class. Oh no, don't run away. Would you like? It's the Pink Panther. Approaching the Pikes Road now. I'm starting to feel it in the legs. Um, Pikes, I don't know if you know it. I think everybody knows it. It's one of the most famous hotels in the world. Um, one of my, well, easily my favorite place to go out um, on a night out. When they are, people like Kylie Minogue, Freddie Mercury, Grace Jones, the list goes on. Look at this. VIP is a loser concept. So it's a cool, it's one of the most beautiful hotels. Um, and you can see San Antonio is all the way over there. So um, yeah, the, the hotel's shot, so we're probably not gonna get in to obviously see it. We never contacted anybody in advance or tried to arrange anything. Just gonna pop in. 
Say hello. Here we are. I know many of you will have been here and relate to this. You can check in, but you can never check out. So we just got back in San Antonio. There's the San Antonio football stadium. And yeah, now we're gonna to go to S Paradise in Eden. We only have two more clubs left. Almost done. So that's it, made it to S Paradise and Eden. Hope you enjoyed that vlog. I think that's it for the day. How long did that take us? What time do we leave? Half ten? Yeah, half ten. Not too bad. Four and a half hours. Four and a half hours. Um, so yeah. Shit. Hello. How are you? So yeah, I'm going to end the vlog on that. I hope you enjoyed it. Subscribe, comment, and uh, yeah. I'll try and do another one tomorrow. Thanks.